Alright, my name is Shane Bentley. Uh, this is mainly just a camera test to see if you can see me or not. Um, what I'd like to do is, uh, I got some notes here. I'd like to start a YouTube channel based solely around comics. Um, all things comics. Um, mainly, I've been watching a lot of uh, people's videos about their collection. Uh, what are their favorites? What are their rare comics? Um, and it got me interested and in, you know, I just got this new camera and I'd like to do the same. I have uh, probably about 5,000 comics. I collected a lot when I was younger. Um, then I went about 10 years without collecting, but I was fortunate enough to have all my old comics at my mom's house. Um, I went and picked them all up and went through them. Uh, none of them were Hardly any of them were in bags and boards, but I, uh, I I really went through them and I had some good comic books. So I started separating them, I started putting them in their boards and bags. I uh, got back into it and I got into it with a vengeance, you know. I started doing a lot of Craigslist surfing, trading for comics. Uh, I ended up getting a lot of good deals. I mean, I got traded a radar detector and a um, a scanner for two boxes of comics and wow it was amazing the things I got I got a lot of real early Conan comics um, in really good shape I like Call the Conqueror I got a lot of nice comics out of them deals um, and there was way more than that you know I traded for some newer comics I got about two huge boxes um, with stuff I don't ever use anymore and God, there was uh, every Deadpool comic there was, um, including his first um, first series. Also, New Mutants '89, his first appearance, um, which was a total score, was in pretty good shape. Also, what else? Um, all the Gen 13 comic books, the variant covers, uh, a lot of spawns, just a lot of newer image stuff. Um, but I love all comics. Uh, I'm a collector and a reader. Um, my favorite Spider-Man, especially Ultimate Spider-Man. I uh, worked really hard to get that whole run, including all the variant covers. And there's a lot. Um, took me a long time, but I can show you this. One of my pride and joys. Got this from eBay. Cost me about 250 bucks, but it was worth it to me to get because there's only about a thousand of them, I believe. And also, there's this is Ultimate Spider-Man number one, the white variant, and then I also got the uh, Dynamic Forces variant, which is close to 5,000 copies. Um, but bam, there it is. It's I would say conservatively graded about 9.6 to 9.8. Um, I take very good care of it. I don't know if you guys can see this very well, but I'll try to get you as close a view as I can. Let's see here. Let's see the corners of that. It's a very nice comic. I love it. It's one of my favorites. Um, I have the whole series, all of them. Let's see if I can give you a little gander in my Ultimate Spider-Man collection. Um, here's the full run. I got some special, you know. Got the Wizard one halves. Get a light. This is a this is a special offer. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Anyways, let's see. I'll give you another peek at some of these. So that's the wizard one half. Here's the regular one half from Wizard World East. Comic. Uh, 
Um, then I have about seven of these covers. All the um, all the different versions: KB, Payless. Uh, gosh, there's a lot. I got the one of my favorites is this one right here, which is the German variant, which are pretty rare. There's not very many of these. Um, but it is flawless. I mean, it's in beautiful shape. Yeah, looks bad right there, but it's just reflection. Their ultimatum, or ultimative. Pretty funny. There's that one. Here's my dynamic forces. One of my favorites. Um, beautiful shape. It's never had to open this because, of course, it's the same story in all of the variant covers. Um, but God, that's a beautiful cover, I believe. Plus, it's never been opened. It's certificate 2,375 out of 5,000, which is it's a beautiful thing. Makes you feel good knowing you got something that a lot of people don't. Um, and I went a long time without being able to purchase nice books. Um, I sold a car and I put a little bit of money into my collection because. Uh, you know, it feels good to do them things, and it's nice to know that it's something that, I mean, Ultimate Spider-Man, these are never going to go down. These are the first Ultimate title. Um, I, they proved to be very well, to do very well. Um, got all the annuals, and then we start with, I'm just super special, and then, bam, once again, another one. I think that's a... KB store variant in bad shape, but I don't care. And then here, let's just bust out these first five. That's number two, I got a couple of them. I'd really like to do something different with my channel. You know, I don't want. Hold on, let's talk for a second. I don't want it to just be a regular channel. I want it to be a community of comic book enthusiasts. I want us to be able to um, do some different things that maybe a lot of channels don't have. Um, I want to be able to react with my friends and my subscribers um, for my first, you know, once I figure this all out, my first thing is I, I'd like to do a little contest and I'm not sure what it will be yet, but I do know I have a lot of nice comics and I have a lot of duplicates that we could play with here. I could just as an example, I mean, bam, right there. I could give away one of these. Um, I don't know what the contest would be, but you know, I'll get some ideas from you guys and we can we can put it together and we'll come up with something. Also, maybe some kind of a comic book swap or trade. You know, there's a lot of comic books I'm still interested in and still would like to have. Maybe you guys have them, um, and maybe they're not your cup of tea. Um, and not just me and you, but you and the other subscribers, you know, we can all interact and, uh, you know, we we'll, uh, can set some kind of a feedback type thing where we can, you know, maybe we'll have to run this into another site other than just YouTube, maybe have YouTube.